question number two, and it says the point slope formula of a line is y equals y sub zero, um, which is equal to m times x minus x sub zero, where m is equal to our slope of our line and x sub zero, y sub zero is equal to a given point um, that's in the information uh, that is in the question. It says um, if two lines part A asks us if two lines are parallel, how are their slopes related? And then what if perpendic perpendicular? So parallel lines, so say we have um, one line with slope m sub 1 and the other line with slope m sub 2. For a parallel line, which is denoted by two up and down straight lines, m sub 1 is equal to m sub 2. So if our lines are parallel, <clears throat> the two will have identical slopes. And our lines are perpendicular, which is denoted by like a little t there m sub 1 is equal to negative reciprocal of m sub 2. So if we know that we have a slope of one line and it wants us to find what the slope of the uh, line perpendicular to that would be, we would take our slope, negate it, and flip it over 1. <clears throat> so that is part A. And then part B asks us to find the equation of the line that is parallel to another line. So parallel, again, we're looking for same slope. Um, the line is 2x plus 4y is equal to 6. So anytime we're dealing with slope, you probably want to put it into uh, slope-intercept form because that's easy, the slope is easily identifiable then. So we're going to subtract 2x from both sides. Get 4y is equal to negative 2x plus 6. Divide everything by 4. And you get y is equal to negative 1 half x plus 3 halves. <clears throat> so our slope then is just negative 1 half. And so if we want um, to find the equation of a line that is parallel to this and goes through the point 1, comma 2, then we're just going to put it back into this point slope form. So we have y minus 2, because that's our given point, is equal to our slope m times x minus 1. And so it's y minus 2 is equal to negative 1 half x plus 1 half. You add 2 and you get y is equal to <clears throat> negative 1 half x uh, plus, this is uh, 4 halves, so this is 5 halves. That's your answer for part B. <coughs> and then now it says, it wants us to do it um, similarly with the same given point. So this is if our line was um, parallel, but it wants us to do it if it was perpendicular. So um, if it was perpendicular, remember, this slope would be negated and flipped. So our new slope then, so m sub 2 is going to be equal to negative of negative is positive, so it's going to be 2. So our new line is y minus 2 is equal to 2 times x minus 1. So that would give me y minus 2 is equal to 2x minus 2. I'm going to add 2 to both sides, and I'll cancel that out. So you just get y is equal to 2x. <clears throat> and that is a, b, and this last part is c.